If one has mastery over one's vayana, one can leave one's body at will. Your karma is not in what is happening to you your karma is in the way you respond to what is happening to you. If you understand there is nothing to lose, because any way you came with nothing and there is nothing to lose, the fear of death will not be relevant. My blessing is may all your dreams not come true, all of your dreams are just exaggerations of what you already know. It is said that if you can remain blissful for 24 hours, your intellectual capabilities can be almost doubled, just settling the internal muddle and allowing clarity to surface can achieve this. The irony is that the more you try to avoid karma, the more it multiplies. Whether you fly or choose to remain in the limitations of the cage, let that be a conscious choice. That people understand this, you did not create life, so you have no business to take it either, whether it is yours or someone else's. Becomes experiential for you, you explode into the oneness of existence, this is yoga, the ultimate union. The walls of self-preservation that you build for today are the walls of self-imprisonment for tomorrow. Your aliveness is going down because you are committing suicide in installments. Have you come into this world to experience life or to think about it? Your mental process is a very small happening compared to the life process, but right now it has become far more important. The more profound your understanding of the human mechanism is, the more magical your life will be. Poor villager comes and throws a plastic bag, that's not the main issue now, the issue is with the affluent, isn't it? If you do not eat for a couple of days, you won't think about God, you will only think about food. Those who work only for a livelihood often feel constrained and suffocated. But when you are deeply involved in your work on every level, you will find activity invigorates you, it does not exhaust you. One of the biggest problems in the world today is loneliness. The science of yoga is, quite simply, the science of being in perfect alignment, in absolute harmony, in complete sync with existence. Responsibility is about being, that's the way life is, not an independent, self-contained bubble but a moment-to-moment -moment dialogue with the universe. If you have no tantra in you, you have no technology to transform people, all you have are words, words can be inspirational and directional, but not transformative. The fundamental difference between a human being and a machine is perception. Yoga is a journey toward a reality in which you experience the ultimate nature of existence as borderless unity. Giving up something for something else is commerce giving up something for nothing is a sacrifice.